Hi folks, I'm Sohan on Android.com where we get on Android every day. Today we're going to show you how to turn your Galaxy S6 into an S6 Edge. Uh, this ROM is really cool. It's called the VN ROM. It's for the Galaxy S6. Now this is actually for the international G920F, uh, but I've installed it on T-Mobile a G925T, so it is fully compatible, and it should be fully compatible with all the Galaxy S6 models, except for AT&T and Verizon, which have lock bootloaders. Um, so definitely try it, Try it. Uh, you should have no problems. Anyway, let me go ahead and show you. That is exactly the same here, as you can see, and about device, and this is actually Android 5.0.2. All right. And you can see it actually changed my model number to 925, 920F. But no worries because this uh, that actually doesn't change your real hardware number. All right, and also let me go ahead and show you people, edge, and all that stuff works. So if you go to edge screen here, and I've actually not got a, I have a, if you notice, I actually have a Lion's ROM running on my S6 Edge. How about this? Pretty much like stock. All right, as you can see, edge light, edge screen, edge lighting. Edge lighting actually works. Uh, also, the edge screen does work, so you can add your five favorites. Uh, or is it six? No, it's five. Uh, and also, the edge lighting will work. Now, make sure you use a case with a lip like this, uh, preferably with a uh, see-through clear case like this. Then the light will reflect off, and you will actually make full use of it. Now, night clock doesn't work because you don't have an edge screen, but other than that, uh, you get everything that's on the S6 Edge, which is pretty much the, uh, the edge, edge lighting, this feature here. Other than that, also you get VN ROM custom settings. Yep, um, you can actually customize your phone. You can see I got center clock, uh, some little customization here, font, date, style. Uh, you can add AM, PM if you want to, uh, get rid of it. Also, you got launcher with pull left. You can go ahead and choose uh, when you pull left instead of pulling up my uh, my magazine or briefing or whatever. It can pull up uh, your favorite apps like my Gmail there. And this ROM is actually really really fast. There's actually no T-Mobile blower. Uh, most of the blower has been removed. Of course, it does have root out of the box. You don't have to reroute it or anything. For battery, you could get three minutes. You can get a ton of different uh, types of uh, battery styles there. So that's nice. Network speed is also show you a status bar carrier label. You can go ahead and enable that. Also, you can enable home and lock button in the status bar. This is where you can actually use it as home button or turn it off. So it's actually hidden here, but you can go ahead and turn it, turn it off. Turn your phone off. Sort of neat. Uh, but other than that, very fast ROM. Uh, if you're using T-Mobile S6, you will lose Wi-Fi calling because it's an international ROM. Uh, but the good thing is the Wi-Fi hotspot tethering uh, works out of the box, all right? Uh, looking very good. So definitely try it out. Turn your Galaxy S6 into S6 Edge. As far as installation, it's pretty easy. Uh, just go ahead and use Twerp and install as normally. I'll have the uh, uh, installation. Actually, no, I'll, let me go ahead and show you. Uh, since the title of this video uh, should be uh, how, to in how to convert it. So let me go ahead and show you that. Otherwise, some of you trolls out there be like, you only showed us the features. All right, power off your phone, volume up, center home, uh, power. Make sure you download the ROM, of course. Let go of the power button when you see the uh, logo there. Keep holding until you see twerp. Now, you first have to root your Galaxy S6. If you don't have it rooted, follow my instructions at galaxyS6root.com. Again, this will work for every S6 model out there except for at and Verizon unless you have a developer version of Verizon. All right, uh, next you're gonna do a complete white. I'm not gonna do it because I already installed it. Um, just do factory reset, go to install, and choose the ROM file you should have downloaded onto your phone. All right, choose that, and you'll get an aroma installer. Uh, simply go through the options you would like, and that's pretty much it. It's pretty cool, VN ROM. Uh, you can go ahead and turn your S6 into an S6 Edge. It says only for G925F, uh, but the developer didn't know that it's actually compatible with all S6 models. So ignore that, agree with this. Do choose backup EFS just in case you, you lose uh, your network. 
Uh, do full wipe. I mean, you don't have to. You already, if you already did a factory reset, you don't need to do this again. Uh, also, apps. You can choose different apps uh, because they will actually remove a lot of the bloatware. If you need Samsung Mirror Link, you know all this. Make sure you choose it. Also, for signal, you can go and choose uh, which signal you want. And also, country code. For T-Mobile, you can go ahead and choose anything, um, but uh, you can go ahead and choose the appropriate country code for your phone. It's pretty much it. If you don't know what it is, it's just do whatever. It really doesn't really make a difference uh, unless you're running certain apps that check for it, but I actually don't know any that does. Uh, that's pretty much it. When it's done, reboot, and you should be on the latest VNROM and turn your Galaxy S6 into an SX Edge. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll have more ROMs coming. I have one for coming for the S6 Edge soon. Uh, as always, don't forget to hit that like, subscribe. Follow me on Twitter, Facebook, or Google+. And as always, I'll stay on Android.